Good afternoon, good people. Welcome back to my channel, The Nature and the Wild. So, it's been quite long. I didn't get a chance to go out because of this extreme cold weather. But today the weather was nice, so I decided to go out to the nearest uh, water lake. We called it Audakak Platz. And uh, the best part of this is that uh, during this time of the winter, we see all different kind of birds here. Um, mostly the water birds, the geese and goats. And uh, we see some red-headed uh, then the black-headed geese and uh, also the tufted duck. I decided to go out with Canon R7 and with my RF100-500 so we can test it out how it's working in this kind of situations, how the autofocus works. So stay tuned with me, I will let you know everything throughout this journey. What I'm gonna do, I see a lot of water birds are there and uh, too much movement. They are flying, jumping over the water. So. I'm hoping to capture some nice uh, action movie, action pictures. So I'm trying to hide myself behind that bush and from there I'll try to capture them. It's quite a wet line. The water was a little bit up, I think, in the evening. Very wet. But who's gonna stop us? That's all about birding. So, so, so what I'm gonna do now, I'm going to test my uh, camera on a shutter priority mode so i put my shutter priority mode so the shutter speed will you are going to only uh, maintain the shutter speed and rest of uh, the settings the camera will automatically decide and it's a very good practice for the beginners so let's try it out So guys, this is quite nice. I see these bird, water birds. You know what's the problem? The water is too fast. <laughs> I see all the red headed are uh, just being lazy laying down on the floor. That's it. Thank you. 
I'm getting really cold now, uh, but I got very nice pictures here today. Um, by the way, a lot of people ask me what kind of uh, tripod we should use. So I have this gimbal head from KNF Concepts and uh, my tripod also from them and it works really nice. You can see there is no lags, nothing. You can move freely from anywhere. So this is quite a good one. Please check their website and uh, get one. It's quite cheap and uh, affordable. So, yeah, so far so good. Got a couple of nice and brilliant shots. I will put them in the video and um, the autofocus is working perfectly fine. I just did um, miss settings basically yesterday when I was making a tutorial video. By mistake, I left something which uh, caused me uh, to hunting the autofocus. It was not perfect at the beginning. So what happened um, in, the, in the menu, if you go to the autofocus cases and uh, I'm normally using the case number two. And when I use the case number two, it says uh, continuous track the subject and all those kind of settings. Uh, I put them in the minus <laughs> and when the bird was flying and doing some action, uh, my autofocus was not persistent. So I changed them to the locked on and keep the track on the subject and it's absolutely working perfectly fine now. Uh, got very nice pictures. So guys i was shooting on the shutter mode priority and it's really good options i want to tell you guys if you guys want to do uh bird in flight please try that functionality and it will give you the um, more control over the camera to get go, to get through so i really enjoyed it um so i came back to the manual mode again um because i was not happy with the iso that time the light is too harsh and just sun is behind me so what i'm gonna do now uh, I put my ISO and I set up everything as per me. So ISO is now on 400, 200 between 400. I'm just varying uh, on the full aperture of 7.1. It is RF 100, 500, and I put my shutter speed at 2000 because there is too much current on the on the water. So if you see if the water is moving too much, the bird is also floating too too fast. And some of the pictures were quite soft, but I just wanted to have them more. I see a black-headed girl is just hovering over. Let's see if I can get a nice picture. It's just towards the sun.
you see this place, it's looking so, so nice with the water park and everything. This place is really good. And uh, now all the birds move a little bit far from me. I cannot reach them with my camera anymore. So I'm trying to go another another side. So guys, I hope you like uh, this little adventure in the cold. And uh, I'll put all the pictures. Tell me what you think. Push me your comments. And uh, I will give you answer. So little bit struggle with the auto focus and the camera is not anything with the with the with the cam or with the lens it's all my settings I tried shutter mode uh, I also tried a little bit the FV mode which gave me quite a good nice results so please stay tuned with me like and subscribe my channel let me and I will try to make more videos in coming front and give you